Ni hao, Chinese reading practice. Today we go on this paragraph HSK1 about shopping and uh, having something and going to do something. And I recommend you to use 30 seconds to read it by yourself. Okay, I'm going to demonstrate first. Tian Zhong, Ming Tian, Yao Chu, Mai, Si Dian. Ta, Hai Yao, Mai, Yi Zhang, Di Tu. Lin Na, 没有自行车，他明天要去买一辆自行车。林娜有一个中国朋友，是个大学生，叫马小红。明天他们跟马小红一起去买东西。Okay, second time. 田中明天要去买词典，他还要买一张地图。林娜没有自行车，他明天要去买一辆自行车。林娜有一个中国朋友，是个大学生，叫马小红。明天他们跟马小红一起去买东西。Okay, so the words or grammar point you have to be in pay attention to here is "要". So it's going to do something in Spanish. Ba, uh, I said, 什么什么 And the other one here is, uh, 是个大学生 So sometimes in Chinese language we don't, um, you know, in Chinese when we describe the quantity of something, we have to use the number, measure word, and uh, the object. But sometimes. For uh, for our speaking, we could omit the number when the quantity is one. So at here, Lina 有一个中国朋友 So Lina have a Chinese friend, and uh, that guy is an uh, undergraduate, a student of the college. So is is he is a. So this a in Chinese we could omit the number. We don't see one one that we just use the measure word ge. Just the measure word instead of that is one. Okay, that's it. You have, um, you have to pay attention to this phenomenon because normally it's just for to understand that for listening that will be fine. And if you don't use that in your daily life, it's okay. Okay, see you next time. 下次见。